A quality seal coating job is obtained by following the recommended mix design and the recommended coverage rate as outlined in the Sealmaster product technical data sheets. Proper mixing begins with adding sealer to the tank first. Add clean potable water to the tank. Allow sealer and water to mix completely for several minutes. Pavement sealer additive is then added to the mix. Refer to sealer specifications for proper additive selection. Additives should be diluted one to one with water prior to adding to sealer. This will better disperse the additive throughout the sealer mix. The agitator should be turning when pouring additive. Allow additive to mix thoroughly for several minutes. The sealer mix should now be slightly thickened to allow for addition and suspension of sand. With agitator turning, add proper amount of sand slowly to the mix. Allow sand to mix in thoroughly for several minutes. The agitator should continue to turn slowly throughout the seal coating process. This will help assure a consistent mix from start to finish. It's important to remember that sand or other fine aggregate, such as crushed slag, should always be added to pavement sealer. Sand will provide slip resistance for both vehicle and pedestrian traffic, as well as added durability. Be sure to refer to the Sealmaster product technical bulletin for proper gradation and amount to use. In some instances, sand may be added to the sealer at the Sealmaster store. In this case, sand may not need to be added at the job site. 